This is one cell tube type after cooler of a large air compressor and you can see several small pipelines connected to bottom of the cooler. This is another cell tube type cooler of the same compressor but there is no such pipelines connected at cooler bottom. Let us see the purpose of these small pipelines connected to the cooler bottom. Suppose this is one cell and tube type cooler where hot compressed air is cooled by cooling water. Usually cooler cell is of carbon steel and cooler tube is of stainless steel or copper. That's why bad fluid or inferior fluid is kept inside tube and superior fluid that means in case of air is kept inside of cell. In this case cooling water is having more thermal fouling and more corrosivity and cooling water is having more debris. That's why cooling water is kept on tube side. Cooling water goes like this and comes out. And air is relatively cleaner fluid and air is kept on cell side. Hot air comes to cooler like this and after heat transfer it gets cooled and goes like this. There will be several baffle like this, baffle flat, like this. So that hot air flows like this. So that there will be good mixing or good heat transfer between cooling water and compressed air. Finally, hot air gets cooled and comes out from the cooler like this. This cooler is called two pass. That means cooling water is coming like this. This is one pass and going out like this. This is two pass. But after use of few years, then there will be lot of debris accumulation inside the cooler tubes. So, heat transfer will not be good and air will not be cooled properly. Then what we will have to do, we will have to take this entire cooler bundle. That means entire cooler bundle will have to be removed in this direction. Then we will have to take out the entire cooler bundle in this direction after taking shutdown for cleaning the entire cooler tube inside. Now this is the actual cooler. This side is cooling water inlet and outlet and it is hot compressed air inlet. This is cold air outlet and for cleaning of these cooler tubes, entire tube bundle to be removed after taking shutdown. But if we do not want to take shutdown for cleaning cooler tube bundle, then this type of fixed cooler tube bundle type cooler is used. Here the bad fluid or inferior fluid that is cooling water is kept on cell side. It comes like this and goes out and better fluid that means compressed air 
comes like this and it goes through polar tubes. So in this case, air will be inside polar tube and cooling water will be inside polar cell. So inside of polar tube will remain clean. Cooling water comes like this and goes like this. Here also there will be baffles like this, baffle plates. like this so that for good mixing cooling water will come like this then go like this then come like this and go out like this so that there will be good heat transfer between cooling water and compressed air and air will flow through the cooler tube in this direction as straight but in this case since cooling water is on cell side, there will be lot of debris accumulation on outside of cooler tubes. So what is normally done, suppose cooling water pressure is about 3 bar, one small air header is kept below the cooler like this, say this is the small header and say air pressure is 5 bar, air pressure is say 5 bar, say this header size is 1 inch, this header is called air bump header. So cooling water pressure is 3 bar and say air pressure is 5 bar, from this header lot of connections are provided below the cooler cell. These connections are either half inch or three fourth inch like this. There will be about 16 to 20 connections below cooler cell. These connections are half inch or three fourth inch and and these connections are provided with one ball valve like this. So during operating condition when the cooler is in operation if we want to clean the cooler tube then we just open these valves and high pressure compressed air flows like this, like this. And this high pressure compressed air cleans outside debris of cooler tube. So entire cooler tube outside is cleaned using this air line or air pressure. This is called air bump connection or air bump line. In this way online cooler cleaning is done using compressed air and all debris goes through cooling water outlet. So there is no requirement of cooler bundle removal or requirement of shutdown. This is fixed tube type cooler with air bump connection at bottom. This is hot air inlet and this is cooling water outlet. At bottom of the cooler, air bump line connection is there for online cleaning. On other side of the cooler, this is cooling water inlet and this is cold air outlet. 